Translation, like I said, would be important for the obvious reason of language barrier. A country, most of the countries in Africa, like from the earlier presentations, have so many languages. So you find that maybe one reason we're not passing on the communication or some of this information is because it's not in the right language. Language will depend on the community you are at at that point in time. Like you know Kenya has 40 something languages, <laughs> so this is just something. So that is just one of them. So it, the, the need for the language will depend on the area you are at that point in time. So now we're with the Maasai's. And this is a model that we're hoping to replicate in other places. Because yes, information may be here, but the Maasai will not read this. So how do we repackage this to be useful to the community at that level? That those are the issues. We are the ones who identified the need. I mean, for obvious reasons. That yes, for obvious reasons. Very interesting. Exactly. Yeah. So we identified as a, as Kenya Healer. That's the Association for Health Information Libraries in Africa, the Kenya chapter. So we felt that if we could simplify these messages on health information in the language of the community, and then we will achieve our goals.